Lizzie Bird, welcome back to Animal Crossing New Horizons. I wanted to try playing the game a little later at night. Um, I took a nap earlier today, don't, don't worry, I'm keeping tabs on my sleeping schedule. But I did want to just sort of see what this game looks like during a nice, cool, early spring night. It just became spring a couple days ago, just in the real world, and I, I guess because of that in the game as well. So I sort of wanted to explore, have some fun in today's episode. Maybe we'll go to some new islands. There's definitely some stuff we can do. But for right now, let's go ahead and collect some weeds and stuff. And if we take a look at our Nook phone, it looks like we already have some Nook miles for something. Call, clam and collected. Dig up clams, collect Nook miles. It's really that simple. The real bonus is that you get to walk along the beach for this one. So as you can see, we get ourselves 300 Nook miles for that. Very cool. And on top of that, is there anything else? We got some bonus stuff up this way, but none of it is quite completed. So we'll keep working on it, of course. Uh, very much so looking forward to it. So I guess, yeah, if I had to focus on anything today, it will be going to the new locations. On top of that though, um, if we can, we should be gathering extra materials so that we can get closer. Oh, I can, can I, did I unequip it? I guess I removed it from my thing. Can I favorite this? Ah, so you can favorite anything really. Interesting. Um, for right now, I do want to do the stone axe. We want to collect as many materials as possible, right? So, oh, 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 ah, okay, hold on, wait, 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 I, I, I want to get the, ah, no! <laughs> I forgot the sprint. Ah, uh, no, get him off, get him off! Ah, uh, not good, ow. Ow, 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 I got stung by wasps. I'm gonna have to go get some medicine. Oh, we got a boo-boo on her eye. But hey, I get a free wasp nest. That's at least something, right? <laughs> not good. I gotta be careful of that moving forward. I just, I totally panicked and forgot I could sprint. Um, oh, we'll be able to do some fishing. Maybe we can find some brand new nighttime fish. That would be cool. But for right now, go ahead and grab all of this. And let's take a look. We got the fishing rod, just like that. Whoop, because of course there are different fish that show up at different times of the month and during the day, and I'm, I'm sure different kinds of weather, right? So that's something we just gotta keep an eye out for. Come on, come on, come on. Ooh, nope, that's a yellow perch. So nothing new, that's all right. But as we're you know continually collecting more stuff, I'm sure things will get easier, so let's just keep with the stone axe. We don't need to use the wooden axe unless we wanna chop down trees. So I guess that's why it's good to have two of each. Maybe you wanna get some wood from something, but you don't actually wanna get the tree chopped down. Well, then you can just do that. So that's good to know about. Um, I should probably also collect some more of these. If we sell these, of course, that will also be a daily Nook Miles thing, so just wanna keep working on all that. So there's lots to do in today's episode in terms of gathering materials, going to new islands, checking out Dodo uh, Airlines. I definitely wanna do that because it's something I said I would do last episode, but I didn't because we got very busy with some other stuff. So for right now, uh, let's take a look. Claim our rewards right here because we got 10 pieces of wood. And that is just sort of chipping away for us. What's next? Catch bugs, we gotta catch five of them. If I see any, I will definitely go for them. I'm pretty sure we can catch the wasp that was chasing us around. I just wasn't ready for it, I was freaking out. <laughs> because the game doesn't like freeze or anything when I do this, so I, I, just, I would have to be really fast with it, you know? But as we play the game more, I'm sure we'll get more comfortable with that kind of thing. I hope the Nook store is open during this time of night. And of course, I'm not gonna demand a 24 hour service from them, they gotta sleep too. But it would be nice if they are open. Catch them at a good time. There we go. And let's pick up some weeds real fast. And I think that if we eat an orange, will that make us feel better with the little boo-boo on our eye? I'm not really sure. But at the least we can also get medicine. But that knocks all the fruit down at once, which is really useful. Oh, here's a bug. Um, so let's go ahead and quickly get our net. And swipe. Oh, it's a little too high up. There we go. Is this like a, is a moth, right? Yes, I caught a moth and I had a ball doing it. Okay, I don't really get the joke. But there's another one over this way. Is this, this is not a moth, whatever it is. Uh, no, it is a moth. Okay, well now we can sell one and keep the other. And there's still plenty of weeds, so. Let's just keep picking these up. I wanna make as much progress with this as I can. Cause it also cleans up the town. The town's been definitely looking prettier the more weeds we get rid of. We just gotta stay on top of it. That's a very active effort. So let's head into the tent now.
and we'll see what's going on. Oh, look at, they're all together now because it's nighttime. That's so cute. They're just spending some family reading time. Uh, Zebra, hello, hello. What would you like to talk to me about? I'm all ears. I don't know if I, why I talked to you because I was actually, uh, well actually, I could say something about the phone, but I don't know if that's anything interesting. Welcome Zebra, how can I help you today? First, we want to sell. Um, just before I forget, I would like to be able to sell all of the weeds we've picked up. Confirm. Actually, anything else? We'll do that. I don't know if we can donate the honeycomb. Probably not. 770 bells, sounds good. We're over 22,000. And should I get started? Uh, I, I guess I should. Um, about building a shop. Yep. Uh, I'd like to donate. So, uh huh, you don't seem to have what I need at the moment. Oh, the full amount of the material donated at once. I realize I shouldn't be, I swear that he said that wasn't the case before. I swear that he did. Okay, about building a shop. What do you need? 30 pieces of wood, hardwood, softwood, and 30 iron nuggets. You don't need to bring everything in at once, see? Once you have 30 pieces, okay, so it's not like you have to bring 30 pieces of all those different separate materials, but you need 30 pieces of each specific thing. Nothing new in there. All right, so we'll keep working on that throughout today's episode, especially as we explore new islands. That'll be cool. Um, but I definitely want to put away any non, I forgot to buy the medicine, the non-essential stuff. But yeah, he should have some uh, medicine for us, so that'll be good. And that should just heal us up, no problem. Hopefully we don't run into too many more wasps. How can I help you today? What's for sale? So you still have the inflatable so sofa and stuff, but I am looking for medicine for 400 bells. Pretty cheap, so just one. Excellent purchase. Yes, yeah, thank you for the 400 bells. Anything else look interesting? I don't think so. Yeah, I think I'll take a pass on other things for right now. Thank you, please don't hesitate to ask me for assistance. All right, goodbye. <laughs> They're so adorable. What a happy little family. And there's another moth flying around at the same exact spot as before. I don't think Blathers is gonna accept any donations right now, so not gonna bother with it, but the medicine is right over this way. Yep, no, 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 I wanted to, whoops. <laughs> Hold on, I wanted to use it. Take medicine. And there we go, our eye is all fixed up. So let's run back home real fast so that we can put away some of the extra stuff we have in storage. And then we'll head closer to Dodo Airlines. Um, I'm sure there'll be different trees with different types of fruit and everything. That'll be cool. Oh, it's so, so nice in here. So relaxing. So I will probably put the oranges in storage, put the moth in storage, and then finally the uh, wasp nest. So let's just keep these things nice and organized. We need 30 in total of each of them. That will take a while, but we got some other Nook Miles stuff done. So let's take a look at that. So first off, anything here? Nope, it's all just this. So we sold 20 clumps of weeds, so that gives us another 100 points. And our next thing is redeem Nook Miles. So we'll have to redeem 500 of them sooner or later, but for right now, not too worried about it. I wanna get the ax back out, because there's definitely, I don't think we hit like this tree. No, we did, okay. Just trying to find the trees we have and have not hit. Might take us a moment. Here we go. I just wanna do this as we're on our way over. Just a great way to multitask, really. And we don't need the, the sticks at the moment, so I will leave that. Got it. But I might leave the oranges as well. I mean, at the same time, maybe I could actually, that's right. Oh, I, I, I do see this now. Remember that on other islands, our fruit might sell for extra. So that would be cool. This game is so relaxing during the nighttime now. And here we are. This is Dodo Airlines. Hopefully they're open. If not, I'm going to feel a little silly, but that's all right. Oh, hey. How are you doing, mister? He's a dodo bird, so cute. Hey, 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 welcome to your one and only getaway to the skies, the Stripe Airport. Nice to meet you, I'm Orville, ground crew for Dodo Airlines. Dodo Airlines, the crew may be flightless, but that doesn't mean you have to be. 
because of course dodos are flightless birds. Uh, if you want to visit another island, invite friends to this one or go on a mystery tour, this is the place to be. So we want to go on a mystery tour, I think. Oh, and we've also got a mail service at this airport. Sometimes the letter is just better, you know? If you want to send someone a note, take a gander at, to your right. We got all kinds of cards at the card stand. By the way, you're Zebra, right? Yep. It's a small island, work us around. I just got a Nook Miles ticket from Tom Nook with the zebra written on it, which makes it yours. So if you wanna use this ticket, you just gotta say the magic words, I wanna fly, you got it? So, zebra, you got anything to tell me? I wanna fly, I want visitors, I want good right now. I wanna fly. Roger. By the way, I got a Nook Miles ticket with your name on it behind the desk here. So use that whenever. So, she has to get the paperwork all official. Where'd you wanna go? I wanna visit somebody, use the Nook Miles ticket. Actually, I'm good, I wanna use the Nook Miles ticket. So you wanna use your Nook Miles ticket, roger. In that case, I'll just use take this ticket I got from Tom Nook. I'm ready to get you in the sky right this minute, but let's just check you're all packed. Tools all ready? Um, time to take off, can you tell me more? Yeah, can you tell me more, I wanna know. Oh, you need to know what a Nook Miles ticket is good for? Friend, you've got the right dodo. The Nook Miles ticket is good for one mystery tour, a journey to the farthest reaches of the imagination. Could be anywhere from the tiny island to atolls. There are no limits. Just ro any rock our pilot dares to land on. We created this service for true fans of uncharted land. For these folks, no island can be deserted enough. You can harvest anything you want, so bring your tools and who knows, you might meet your next neighbor. Tickets available only at Nook Shop. I'll for void where prohibited. Dodo Airlines does not assume responsibility for anything ever. <laughs> and that about sums up the epic thrill ride we call the Dodo Airlines Mystery Tour. So we can leave right now if you got your tools ready and everything. What do you say? I think it's time for a takeoff. All right, let's get you airborne. Saving. Do not touch. <laughs> okay, I, I like imagining he's saying that <laughs> as he just like, just very frantically starts flapping on the keyboard. Dodo one, this is Dodo Tower Wilbur. You copy, got a walker who needs wings, over. Roger, ready when you are. Okay, have a good flight, friend. And when you need to travel, just think, what would Dodos do? All right, D-A-L, Dodo Airline. Ah, look at him go. <laughs> this is so cute, I love that guy. All right, we are two down and docked at the target island. Delta Oscar, Delta Oscar, go. Oh, D-O-D-O, -D -O. that's, uh, I guess not Morse code, I don't know what the word is for that, but, you know, the first letter of each of those is Dodo. Delta Oscar, Delta Oscars, go. First time getting your pontoons wet on tour? Let me brief you on a mystery island procedure. First, we run finders keepers protocol here. Lumber, fruit, fish, whatever, yours if you can carry it. Next up, break a tool, forget one, I can requisition you a replacement, gotta charge a miles out. Okay, that's fine. Also, there's one red line item you need to memorize like your favorite latte order. Anything you leave behind stays here. We don't come back to these places, ever. I actually burned the flight plans afterwards. Security reasons, can't explain more than that. I think that's everything, go explore. If you wanna get into trouble, ask yourself, what would dodos do? Meanwhile, I'll be in a holding pattern here. Get in touch when you need tools or travel. Go catch some bees and chop some trees. All right, sounds good. And whoa, look at this, we even, hey, there's somebody over there. Is she an eagle? I think so, wow. So we got a crafting bench. Can I take these? I feel bad sort of taking them. What are they though? Um, these are red hykana, or hy hykinth, hyacinths, hyacinths, I don't know. Um, but I can take them without having to dig them up, which is cool. Why am I taking weeds? <laughs> I don't know, I'll, I'll get rid of them once I need to. Is one of them on fire over there? Or is there a campfire behind it? Yeah, okay, that was a weird look. Anyways, super duper exciting. I definitely want to sort of get new materials. It's raining here as well, so quite the aesthetic. Uh, we'll keep chopping trees. So it looks like oranges are here as well. Are those pears? Are those coconuts on the palm trees? Yeah, I don't think pears grow on palm trees, so probably coconuts. But as soon as I can, I'll try to get over there. Uh, boop. So what kind of wood does this drop? Looks like the same kind of normal and soft wood. Can we knock down I mean, we could, but it probably wouldn't get us anything. So it's not worth worrying about. Oh, and there might be some new fish here as well. There's so much to find, but the fish is sort of a bit of a trouble because I'm just not going to have the inventory space for it. I don't need a co-wire. I should probably just drop that. Drop item. But the fruit is exciting, at least some of the woods. Ah, oh, but that's a huge fish. And there's a snail over here. Uh, let's get the snail. 
Ready, set. Whoop. We got him! Ah, oh, he's so cute! Look at this little guy! Yes! I caught a snail! It's not much to brag about. That's fine. It's a wonderful snail still. So, so far, I'm not uh, ready to catch fish, unfortunately. It's just we don't have the inventory space for it. It'd be cool if we could go to the Dodo Airline guy and just have him send back some of the stuff we're finding. But I'll go across and talk to that eagle lady in just a moment. That'd be cool. But in the meantime, I'm gonna use the most of this stone ax. One. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, uh, no, 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 run away! <laughs> I just can't switch fast enough. Ow. Twice in one night. Ow, 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 ow. I got stung by wasps. Oh, darn. That always stinks. Let's take the wood. I guess I'll take the beehive. I don't know if I want to keep with that, though. Um, I gotta be careful. That's for sure. Because I don't know what happens if I get stung twice. Won't be able to see. Um, yeah, things aren't too bad here. I don't think we need the wasp nest. I will, though, eat the... No, not drop it. I wanted to eat the oranges. Hold on. Pick that up. What happens if I eat more than one? I don't know. Eat one. Yeah, one out of 10. Does that mean we're hungry? Is there hunger in this game? I'm not sure. Okay, eat this as well. There we go. Uh, and keep at it. There we go. So I definitely will get more. Are these coconuts? I never even checked. Yep, coconuts. They'll be fun to sell at the least. Probably will make us a pretty penny. I can only hope. And I definitely need to dig up that rock over that way, but that might have to be its own endeavor is getting more rocks. Um, more uh, of the certain types of stone. But I'm glad to get the Hycanus. Because a lot of this stuff, you know, it just sort of uh, keeps stacking, it seems. Oh, I didn't need the weeds. I will get rid of the weeds soon. I really want to go fishing, though. <laughs> oh, hey, here she is. Hi. Celia, I wasn't expecting to meet anyone on this tour. I'm Celia, and you're Zebra from Stripe. I'm glad you stopped to talk to me. Uh, one thing I love about traveling is the chance to make new friends. All right, well, how are you doing? It must be true what they say about how travel broadens your horizons. This change of scenery has given me a new perspective on life back on my island. I like it well enough, but move to my island. Oh, wow, that's such a great idea. Thank you for the encur for encouraging me. When I ran into you, I never expected to be invited to live on your island unless you were just teasing me. Do you really mean it, Feathers? You'll love it there. <laughs> of course I didn't, that'd be so mean. Oh, this is all so exciting. I can't wait to start pa packing up for my big move after this tour. If I remember right, I'm supposed to contact someone named Tom Nook about relocating, Feathers. I'd better do that before I forget. All right, well, I hope you enjoy it. You have anything else to say? This will be a big move for me, so I'm glad you'll be there when I get to Stripe Feathers. Yes, I will be. It'd be awkward if I wasn't. <laughs> Anyways, that's a lot of fun. I'm glad that we found a new villager friend. Right now, I'm just going to continue collecting all this. And then I want to eat up maybe a couple of the coconuts, but I probably should just eat up the oranges, actually. Um, so, because I'm very curious about, I never noticed the hunger level on the top left. So I don't know if our characters has not been doing so well. I feel bad now. They've been starving this whole time, I didn't even know. But we also have a shovel that we can use now. If we go like this. Yeah, there we go. But it only got me clay. I was hoping for uh, some more of that specific stone. So I might end up dropping that, I'm not really sure. I definitely don't need any of this. So back to uh, this other side, maybe. Ready? Uh, can we not? Oh, whoa, there we go. So we've basically gone full circle at this point. There's a couple more trees we can whack at, which is definitely what I want. One, two, and three. And I will pick up these oranges this time, but I am not too worried about it. I think I got it, I can't tell. Um, mostly just because we can get some at home, you know? Don't have to worry too much about that. But I'm glad we found coconuts for the first time. And we can craft some things, but I don't know if there's really too much I wanna craft at the moment here. Oh, there's a message in the bottle. Interesting, okay. So I'll make the most of that in just a second. Got it? 
And I think I'll drop the clay for now. Drop that item. And I should probably eat more oranges. No, not drop it. Darn it. <laughs> Sorry. Sometimes it's a little weird. You just gotta learn the controls over time. So eat one. Because we're still not at full. Eat another. I don't know what happens if we get to full. Maybe it just won't let us eat anymore. Because of course we're extra powerful when we are eating. We can like hit rocks and take them out in one hit. Uh, so let's see what that's about. Message in a bottle, open it up. Dearest whoever you are, whilst ta taking a much needed hot bath, my mind dreamed up the most fabulous idea for a DIY recipe. Of course, I believe great ideas such as mine must be shared. It would please me if you made it. Far away wishes, Pearl. All right, so what is a bird bath? Very fancy. Huh, okay, sweet. I learned a DIY recipe for a bird bath. We already have a bird house. I would like to make a little bird sanctuary. That would be so cool. So we'll do that for sure. So I think I've smacked all the trees around here. Seems like it to me, except for this one maybe. One, two, and three. So we will pick all this stuff up and then we can go fishing with whatever slots we have remaining, which probably won't be too many. But that was still a lot of fun. I think we go to more than one island, right? All right, eat one. So it looks like I've actually hit my cap for the the flowers, the high count. So you can see I have like an extra red one. I don't really want just like one taking up a slot. See what happens. You're too full, you couldn't possibly eat anything else. So I'm going to drop that, and I'm also going to drop this red high can of. No, I wanted to drop it. Okay. Well, it looks very fancy in our hair. Uh, but we'll drop it. And. Let's get a fishing rod. Who should we go for? We got a fishy right over this way. Boom. Landing it right next to him. There's a lot of fish out right now, too. Oh, I wish I had an open inventory at the moment. I wonder what's gonna happen if it brings us to a different island after this, because it didn't say, maybe not though. Okay, right now, fish it up. Don't worry about anything else but catching this fish. And that's a new one. That is a dace. Hope I have some space. And we just barely do. We have space for two more though. Very exciting. Let's try to catch this guy and see what we get. If there is a, uh, a fish that we catch we already have, I might let it go so that we can just increase our chances of getting more stuff, you know? Are you gonna take that or what? You seem a bit distracted. Oh, almost scared it off. If we scared it off, that would have been a problem. Come on now. This guy just doesn't see. Maybe he's like hard of vision. Oh, oh wow, immediately going for it. Maybe it was just charging up, it's a can. I caught an empty can. Aren't you supposed to catch a fish before you can you can it? <laughs> this empty can should be repurposed. I've got an idea for a DIY recipe. Oh, really? I'm very curious to see what you, you came up with. Uh, DIY recipe. Wow, succulent plant. Oh, that's so cool. Okay, we gotta keep the can then, because I wanna make that. And that means we have space for one more little fishy. I think there was one right over this way. Let's give this a toss. I can't see. Yeah, we sort of messed that up. I'm gonna pull it back. Try to get a better angle. Still can't really see. Where is he? Where did he go? Did we scare him off? No, he's right there. Hopefully this is good enough. It's getting closer to him. Come on now. I have no idea where he went. Oh! That's it! <laughs> you can just barely see it. Awesome. Uh, do we have this one? A Crucian Carp, my skills are sharp. sharp, yes we do. So I'm going to let you free. Today is your lucky day. Release. Aw, I love his little jump into the water. There should have been, yeah, another big fish over this way. He's just sort of swimming around the, the river, enjoying himself. Come on. Got it. Come on, come on. Is it another? Dace. Maybe it's a sign I should keep it, but there are some more fish over this way. So you know what? Release him. Oh, I feel bad. I just released a freshwater fish into the salt water. I shouldn't have done that. That wasn't very nice to do. I'll try not to do that again. Um, here we go. Oh wait. Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> this one this guy's even bigger than before. Oh man, he's huge. Come on, come on, he's gonna be a tough one, isn't he? 
and it is probably another sea bass. So it looks like we're not getting anything new here. That's unfortunate, but we're just gonna roll with it. I have a full inventory at the moment, basically, so it might just be good to leave. I don't think we can get more than one snail, like we can't stack it up. That's another huge fish, though. And it's a huge river fish, so maybe I should also, we should release it back in the sea. It's not fair to just take them out of their habitat like that. Um, release. Uh, I keep on scaring off the other fish like that. But come on, here's this last guy we'll try for. Oh, come on, come on. Just turn a little bit more. Oh, I turned the wrong way. There we go. A little bit of a better angle. I mean, it leads right into the ocean over this way, but it's still not a nice thing to do. Come on. Oh. Ah, uh, another? A black bass. We do have, we have gotten one of these, but we're just gonna leave it at this point. I don't wanna spend too much more time catching and releasing fish, especially since we could be selling them. Hey, buddy. Bell bottom jazz, this is st stove top socket wrench. Do you require assistance? Over. Uh, I'm ready to go home. You ready to pun pontoons and fly soaring wind flower here back to stripe? You positive? Be very positive, because I wouldn't want you leaving anything behind. So again, you ready? Yep. Roger, lifting off November Oscar Whisker, <laughs> now. All right, well there was our first experience with the Dodo Airlines. What a fantastic one. I had a lot of fun with that. We'll probably go to another island today. I definitely need to keep up with everything else though. <laughs> a little salute, that was great. Well, thank you for your service, that was a blast. So while we had fun, there's still plenty left to do. Uh, so one thing I wanna do for right now, check out our Nook Miles. There we go, Rough Hoon. Island development is Nook Inc's goal. We need a lot of materials to make that happen, so we're giving away Nook Miles based on how much wood you've chopped from trees. We got 120 so far, so that's another 500. And, is there anything else? Here we go, good things in store. I'll reward you with miles based on the number of items you have in storage, hmm? Using the convenient storage feature will make life on the island more pleasant. I mean, that's only available in the homes, right? I think so. Uh, Anything else? I figured we would get something for traveling, but I guess not. We need to catch one more bug. But right now we are totally full on inventory. I don't know if the wood will be ready to be chopped again. Oh, it looks like Pashmina's out for a little late night stroll, just like we are. Whoa, hold on. Oh, it looks like they did get restored then, I think. That's good. So we'll keep working on all that. Let's talk to Pashmina real quick. Hi. Wow, is your face okay? It's super creepy. Looks like some kind of Halloween mask because we got stung by the wasp. Hang on, you didn't worry the wasps, did you? Those little buzzy bodies just love to go off, kidders. If you don't touch the things, they'll heal eventually. Or if you want to speed things along, use medicine. Yeah, don't worry, I'm fine. Uh, I've already used medicine for one of them earlier. Oh, this tree though. So maybe it isn't restored. There's still plenty parts of the island though where I have not chopped any trees, so we'll be fine, I hope. Uh, down this way, two and three. We gotta be getting closer to it, for sure. Really wanna be able to help uh, Tommy Nook. I'm gonna drop that, I didn't really mean to get the seeds. Anyways, grab that, and this. And I'm sure there's plenty of things to pick up along the beach, but I can't worry about that too much right now. Very happy we were able to get the uh, coconuts, though. That was fun. We'll definitely sell those, and that should make us, hopefully, a lot of bells. So there is all that, how are we doing? I'm almost at 30 for two of them. I think this actually will be 30 for the normal wood. Let's take a look. Yep, exactly 30 normal wood, we need one more hardwood and then a lot more softwood. Not again, not again. Ah, uh, let me in, let me in, let me in, no! No, 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 no! <laughs> ah, no, and we fainted! No! Oof. That's not good. Do we get something taking this thing out? Getting stung by wasps hurts. Getting stung again before you can recover makes you faint, but at least you got, get some miles for that. I don't want you to be uncomfortable though, so take some medicine to heal up. Yikes, well at least we got some miles for it. Teary-eyed crybaby were our keywords there. Do we lose anything for getting passed out? I sure hope not. Doesn't look like we actually have all of our stuff still. Wow, can't believe that happened. Anyways, that's gonna be the last of our hardwood that we needed. 
Uh-huh, my pockets are full already, so you actually can't hold more than 30 of the hardwood or any of the types of material then. Yep, okay, so we're just looking for softwood now. And at this point, I might wanna go and donate these now so I don't miss out on collecting more stuff, because the more we can get, the better. So for right now, donate these two, sell some coconuts, really just try to open up our inventory a bit. That'd be fun. Boop. How can I help you today? Oh, you can help me, all right. Let's, uh, well, actually, I'm helping you. So, I'd like to donate. Oh, you'll make a donation? Thank you so much for helping. Seems you're carrying some wood and hardwood. Did you want to donate 30 pieces of each? Those are for you. Here you go. And, okay, I guess we gave the other stuff to him. Thank you so much, now we're halfway to our donation goals. Thank you, let me offer you some cute yellow tile flooring and a shoji screen. So we do get some stuff in return, which is nice. We love your cooperation with donat in donating the remaining materials. And I will continue to cooperate, but we're not quite done. Uh, how can I help you? I wanna sell. Of course, what exactly are you offering? Um, for right now, I don't wanna sell all of them. I don't know if I can choose a specific group of it, but I can sell the black bass. I don't wanna sell the sail, snail or the dace because I can donate those. Um, look at all the fine things you've brought in today. Allow me just a moment to run the numbers. All done, I can buy those for you for 1,900 bells. Very nice. Okay, so 24,000 bells in total right now. We're still trying to earn up more, of course, so that we can pay off our debts sooner or later. So, for right now, ooh, that's a new bug. Maybe that's a little cicada, I think they're called. Let's go to it nice and slow, because I don't want it to hop off on us. Hup. Yeah, look at that. That is a tiger beetle. I was totally wrong. I pounced first. Indeed you did. So we got some new Nook stuff. Yeah, that should have been for the Nook Miles Plus as well, so there we go. So yep, five, or oh, sell fruit right there. That's gonna be 150, and over this way, got Nook Miles Plus. So I'm hoping that we can plant these little things that I have, but I guess I don't really know. Here, I'm just going to do it right, right here in the open. So we got a shovel. If I dig this up, and I try to bury in hole. That didn't seem to work the way I thought it would. Um, that's not what I was looking to do. Um, look, I dug up a red, yeah, okay. So I guess they're really only for clothing. I can't really use those to plant more stuff. That's sort of a shame, but now that we know, we can just go and sell them. I don't really need them for the vanity of it, so. Might as well, there's lots of moths around this time of night. Very fancy. But yeah, I feel like we've had the opportunity to catch a couple things we normally wouldn't find because of the time of day. We'll check the, uh, the little encyclopedia later to make sure of that. I wanna sell. So, we have a bunch of this just to get rid of and one clump of weeds, because what else am I doing with it? Uh, look at all the fine things you've brought in today. 1,130 bells, very nice. So we, we made a couple of thousand of bells through our little trip today. That's always good. And we'll try to go back to it again in the future. I don't know if there's other villagers we can maybe find. Probably not for right now, but eventually. So, go back to the stone ax and try to chop down more stuff with the trees. Okay, so this one is, oh no! Oh, bad timing. Oh no, thank you for your service, faithful stone ax. Okay, we'll go and make a new ax soon, but in the meantime, I wanna get all that figured out. I definitely wanna start chopping down some of the trees on the other side over there, but to do that, I'll need to make another axe, so lots to do, <laughs> lots to do. It'll be fun, though. So, I can put in storage all of the other types of wood, though, and also all of our little fish and bugs. Uh, put in storage, put in storage, and in storage. Also, we can try out the new things he got. It's a shoji screen, place on the wall. Whoa, and also cute yellow f f uh, tile flooring. Horizontally or vertically? Wait, what? Uh, what do you mean? Oh, there we go. We had to like take it off. All right, well that's not the best color combo. I actually like it with that. That's a very nice looking thing. So we'll put this in storage and same thing with this. Wow, that's actually quite relaxing. I like it. 
Well, hopefully we can continue to enjoy that. But for right now, I want to um, keep at it with everything else. The best way to do that is going to go and make some more stuff. The problem is I don't have the right materials at the moment. Hmm, so yeah, what I need then is I need to pull out the shovel and attack some stones. If I can get one of the fancy pieces, I think, whatever they're called, the shiny rock. Oh yeah, let's grab all this then. Because I don't think we have the right materials to make the ax. I'll have to double check. Let's, let's do that right now. Um, oh, rescue service. No, okay. I've already seen this. I don't know why I thought I hadn't. Nope. DIY recipes right here. And so this is our stone axe, yep. So we need more wood for that. Flimsy the axe in three pieces of normal wood. Okay, so I can actually make that right now. We don't need the uh, fancy stone. But I will have to go to storage. Not too bad though. And then I'll just purchase the flimsy axe from the store. It just sort of expedites some things in a way that's useful. So I'd rather just deal with it that way. So first things first. Uh, Go to my storage. How do I do that again? Wrong button. This way. We got lots of stuff. We are actually starting to run a little low. Move to pockets for right now. And we do have a couple of those stone pieces, but I need 24 more. So we're, we're a while's way off to uh, donating what we need. Okay, back to the Tom Nook Town. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Big scary spider. Oh, hey, 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 it's all right, it's all right. I'm not gonna hurt you. What if I walk away? Ah, 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 no, whoa. I don't like it! I don't like it! I was, oh! No more bugs! I thought, you know, maybe all the creepy crawlies would go to bed during the night time. Is he still out here? No, he's gone. Maybe that's for the better. That was like a tarantula. I never wanna see that again. Man, oh man, too much excitement for one night. I was hoping for a nice somber night out, and for the most part we got that, but man. Uh, let's go ahead and buy our flimsy axe. Uh, I wanna, what, what's for sale? Here we go. So first off, uh, flimsy axe, 800 bells, I'll buy it. And we will just use that to create a, another blunt stone axe because we could use a sharp axe, but it would knock down the trees as well, which isn't always what I want. Eventually we would run out and that'd be a problem. So there we go, let's do it. There we go. Oh, I still can't believe we got attacked by a spider and two wasps. It's all done for now. And does that get put to our, I guess we'll have to find out when we go outside to see if that Im immediately gets put to our little wheel. Um, it does, perfect. So we're going to actually change to the pole so that we can start running around. Whoop! And stone axe, let's get to it. So we need a lot more of the softwood is what we're mostly focused on, but honestly, the more of everything, the merrier. We will eventually need it. Even the oranges and stuff, you know? Just put in the storage. This tree has nothing else to offer though, weird. There's a lot of weeds on this part of the island. Why are none of these trees dropping anything? That's weird. Uh, well, there was one piece over this way, so maybe I'm just not getting it. Oh, there it goes. So that's soft wood. Whoa, watch it. There we go. It might just be the viewing angles that weren't working out too well. Oh, is there a present over there? If there is, I won't be able to reach it if it's on the other part of the island, but it looked like there was something in the distance. Hard to tell. Ooh, that's a new butterfly, for sure. Here we go. Gotcha. Ooh, look at this, beautiful. Emperor butterfly, it's not your average monarch. Cool. So back over this way, we still have plenty of things to pick up, including some softwood. We needed about 10 softwood more than what we currently had. Let's take a look, 24 now. We're getting there. 
this one only have two? Weird. And what about over this way? We got this orange tree. Looking good. So a little bit closer, 25. The thing is the softwood is definitely the least common for me. So we just gotta keep at it with every tree. But it will be worth it to have a more organized shop for Tom Nook and his sons. That'll be great. You know, just propelling the island forward in any way possible is always a good time. Sort of accidentally picking up some weeds. I definitely need to go through this part of the island again at some point and just get as many of the weeds as possible. Just spend a good chunk of time doing that would be nice. And come over this way, do a little bit more of the same. Got it. And then lastly, over here, I'm trying to be ready for if the uh, the wasp nest shows up again, but I don't know, I just haven't been doing so well with that. We need one more softwood. It's all we need. So let's hope we can find it. There it is. Whew. So let's grab this stuff and we're good to skedaddle for now. I do hear... Aha, there it is. Oh, we gotta be quick with this because it's about to go. Oh boy, oh boy, slingshot. Here, no. Um, there it is. I was gonna say, it's gonna go over the, 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 the cliff. We can't reach it from there. We got a present. So what's gonna be going on with this present then? Open it up. A telescope? Oh cool, we'll have to go check that out a bit. I'm very happy about that one. So moving back over here, we need the pole again. But you always gotta keep your ears out for that. Can I not jump across from here? Oh, there we go, found it. Very tiny little area to do that. Oh hey, I need to catch my breath and just kinda flop to you, you know? Watching the sky is really common. And how is Biff doing? We haven't talked to Biff today. He's right out here. Everybody's by Biff, Biff's house. Yeesh, I feel like I'm looking at something I really don't wanna see. Huh, oh, it's you. <laughs> I thought a zombie invasion had started. Be careful shaking those trees, all right? I'll try. What's going on, Squirt? Let's talk. Hey, I heard your tent finally hit the gym and bulked up into a house. Congrats, Squirt. I'm thinking I might drop by sometime to check on your free weight situation. Keep an eye out. I would love that. We should, we, you should visit. We'll have a snack together. So let's go ahead, donate the, the rest of the wood, and then maybe sell some stuff. Definitely some of the oranges wouldn't be too bad to get rid of. But yeah, very productive day if you ask me. We got to a new island. We got a good chunk of progress with some other stuff. So I want to sell. Uh, oranges, weeds, and that's it. Maybe one of these wasp nests, because we have a couple now. Look at all the fine things you've brought in today. Uh, 2,040 bells for that, not bad. And we're not quite done with you. About building a shop. I have a donatable amount of softwood. Softwood and iron nuggets. Yep, these are for you. So we now just need to figure out the iron nuggets. Uh, so to thank you, I'd like to offer you a tennis skirt. All right, not exactly my style, but I appreciate the offer. We love your cooperation in donating the last type of material we need. So I do want to take a look at everything we get. So, uh, where is that? Very fancy. You know, if you want to wear a tennis skirt, looks like a pretty good one to have. Uh, so I want to sell. I'll probably sell it because I don't don't plan on using it. Um, so there we go. I wonder how much he'll accept the. I hope he's not offended. Three hundred sixty, not too bad. He seems impartial to it, so that's good. It's just business. So you know what, also we should check out, since we haven't today, Nook Stop, we have plenty of Nook Points, so hopefully we can get something. Um, redeem our Nook Miles. So there's a Nook Miles ticket again if we wanna go back out. Custom Design Pro Editor, Pocket Organization Guide. Details on this. Information on Pocket Organization so you can carry more items. Really? It'll give us more inventory space. Well, we're saving up for that then. That would be so useful. But I also really want the new hairstyles, but that's more of a vanity thing, so it can wait. I think utility should come first. Uh, let's leave. Thank you for your patronage. You are welcome. 
So sooner or later, we'll be able to do that. But for right now, I'm having a blast. There's only a couple things I wanna do. I think I wanna take a quick run throughout the whole island and just try to uh, find any rocks to hit where we might be able to get a couple of nuggets. That would be best. Honestly, there's not too many rocks on this island from what I've seen. Uh, at least I haven't memorized where many of them are. I have also had sort of a bad habit of destroying them, so I need to stop doing that. Okay, here's one. Ah, oh, but it broke. What was it, was that an iron nugget? Yes, it was, okay. Now we might as well take the rock. I mean, what else are we gonna do with it? Yeah, let's take it out. Not what I meant to do. I think it's because we're really high on hunger right now. But I mean, more rocks will pop up eventually. Right now, let's get across this river and get back to our shovel and keep running. And I'm sure there'll be some on the uh, the upper parts of the island that I can't quite reach right now. I'm guessing we'll need a ladder or maybe like a rope or something or stairs. Be nice if we could just make stairs at some point. I don't know when that kind of thing starts becoming a thing we can do, like landscaping. That has to be a, something at some point, right? Who knows? Anyways, back over this way. It does definitely seem like iron nuggets are a much more difficult material to get than wood is, because there's always plenty of trees, but there's only a couple of rocks. There we go. Back to the shovel. Yeah, I don't see, oh, here we go. Didn't see too much, but there's at least one. It's just a normal rock. That's sort of a shame, because that's like an entire rock gone. I always love this little beach in the back, but there's nothing really there for us. Ooh, I'm tempted with that little pond fish, but I'm a little more focused on seeing if there's at least one more rock, but there isn't. There's just like not a lot of rocks around. I don't know if more rocks will pop up over time. I hope so. Hope we didn't just destroy all of our, our rock uh, reserve. That's the wrong thing. I'm not gonna be able to catch a fish with that very easily. I mean, it's probably possible, but I'd rather not. Doesn't seem very nice. Okay, so can we get his attention? You'd think we would in this tiny little pond. Ready, go. Oh, come on. <laughs> we can do it, I know we can. But yeah, playing this game during the nighttime is actually very fun, very relaxing. There we go. Oh, come on, let's see what we get for this fish. This is probably the last one of the day. It is going to be a carp. Uh, if I catch another, they can carpool. So I think that's actually our first carp. Very exciting to see that. So let us get back with the vaulting pole. Whoop, pretty nice. And we'll go back inside for the day. Lots of fun in today's episode. Lots of collecting, exploring, all that kind of stuff. And I'm very excited because next episode, there should definitely be Blathers Museum and also maybe a new villager with whoever the name of the person we ran into earlier today's episode was. Uh, for right now, I gotta put a lot of this into storage. Except for the essential stuff, really. Which is to say all of our tools. I like this radio song. Yeah, you got the Emperor Butterfly. Oh, I wanna put this outside as the telescope. Maybe we could use that, that'd be so cool. Uh, Iron Nugget, put it in storage. And two more things I wanna do. Put the telescope out, get our Nook Miles, and then be all wrapped up for today's episode. So we'll put this on this side. It'd be cool if we could put like a little patio over this way at some point, just like little knickknacks, like maybe some sitting areas, a telescope so we can look out during the night. Can I actually use it? That'd be so cool. Uh, whoa. Oh, I don't think it works that way. Oh, that would be so cool. Oh, well, maybe at some point we'll find one that actually lets us do something. And we, we can at least make it look like we're looking through the telescope. And, like I said, Nook Miles time. Uh, we have our Nook Miles right here. Bugs don't bug me. You can earn miles for filling out your Critterpedia. Oh yeah, we didn't see that. We need to look at the Critterpedia soon. But you know, for right now, I'm all tired out, so I think we'll leave it like that. So yeah, with that being said, that is gonna wrap it up for today's episode of Animal Crossing New Horizons. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.